So I found my way into real estate after spending some time in the corporate world. Trying to grow in that space was interesting. I, <laughs> I gained a lot of skills and experience, um, let's just say that. But, you know, sometimes you work so hard to a point and you're communicating what you want, trying to fix problems and affect change and that doesn't happen. So for me, instead of continuing to combat that, I decided to leave an environment that wasn't really good for me and decided to really take the reins of my future and, you know, go at it for myself. Real estate was one of those things that kind of smacked me on the top of the head. Just, you've always had an interest in this. Why not? Go for it, take your time, you know, learn the industry, really dip your toe in and then uh, make a run for it as soon as you feel ready. And that's what I did. I found a way out and um, I really like the idea of real estate and being in real estate because I have total control of that customer experience. I'm a customer service monster with a heart of gold. That's what I like to say. I get really prickly when things are not going well for my client or customer. <laughs> I have ownership of that and I have control, you know, if there's something that we can't foresee in the process, you know, those things do happen and we deal with them as they come. But <laughs> I really, I really take pride in that. If something's going well, it's because we're working great as a team together. Myself, our lenders, you, seller, buyer, whoever you are watching this. And um, we really bring it, bring it home. We, we hit it out of the park and I hope to always deliver a really positive and memorable experience. Being in real estate, we get to of course look at a lot of properties. It's not all the glitz and glam you see on the HGTV channels and stations people. It's a big, heavy, emotional lift buying properties, selling property. So um, I, I like to really guide you through that process and make sure that it's the best process it can be.